Hello, everybody. Welcome to episode 18 of Haven Cave Block. Uh, today, well, we get this item that is right here in my hand, and I'll show you how it gets done. All right, folks. Uh, we're getting started here with this. Uh, you may have noticed last episode that... Uh, it said hosting locally. That that's because I've uh, switched from having it on a server to uh, independent right now. I don't like that right there. No, no, no. I'm gonna move this back in here. So today I already have a idea of what I want to do. And uh, part of it requires me setting up down here for the power for this. Because we still don't have a basic power room set up yet. Uh, oh yeah, I, I stopped uh, hosting it onto a public one. And I wanted you guys still to see this up here. Um... Because I've, I've already determined that there's probably about uh, six more episodes left of this pack, at most. Um, okay, we've got this here. Put this in here. Fill those up super quick. I want cable, both this type and this type. Um, well, I was working on setting up better power flowers, and well, at a certain point, you have to craft uh, the orange uh, matter. And, well, if you notice here, it requires one Philosopher's Stone for every yellow fuel that it has to make. Um, and instead of making a second Philosopher's Stone, I figured we will use a Crafter for the orange, uh, well, for the higher matters and the higher fuels and stuff. And uh, I think we just set it right here, where we already have access to uh, refined storage. Uh, so, a little bit of remodeling here on the floor. So, that should all be good. Close this back in. Never have to touch it again. All right, so we'll set down the crafter here. And in here, we can say orange, or we can type matter, or not matter, uh, fuel. We want the fuel. We can do that, but we want to change this from uh, Excerpt to excerpt C, which that means the Philosopher's Stone will stay in here when it makes the yellow fuel. So we can click apply to make this yellow fuel. Now we'll need a uh, extractor or a not external storage. Um, importer, exporter, importer. Imports into the system, right? Yeah, I think that that the imports into the system. We hear it crafting the stuff over there. 
Oh, and by the way, that one drive gives us 16.3 million. So, just so you know. So, we'll have us at Refine. We have three of these and one of these stack wrenches. Or stack, it's all the wrench and sub wrenches. Put the stack upgrade there, the speed upgrades there. That will help us out. Now, we can say crafter. Uh, it doesn't need to be anything more than tier one crafter. There we go. And we can set that there. Grab the wrench here. And now it goes into here. So now we can take out here the yellow and orange fuels. Uh, set the yellow one in here first. We'll change that to a process. Say yellow fuel. Right. We'll shift click. No, 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 we want it process. Might have to do it this way. So yellow fuel requires lime fuel. Two, three, four. Put it in there like that. Press create. And now we can put that in there. And we should be able to now make yellow fuel. Uh, enough yellow fuel to make an orange matter. Well, you notice here, it's putting the stuff over here, but it's not processing because we still need to add the philosopher's stone that we left over here into here. We're going to set this to remember so that it always remembers that the Philosopher's Stone is there. So now we should be able to get orange matter. Yep. All right. So now this is yellow fuel. We need four yellow fuel. So we'll switch this over to process, say four yellow fuel, make one orange fuel. You can drag and drop it into here. Okay, so now Uh, matter. Let's see here, the orange matter becomes white matter. So we can teach that to this. Toss that in there. And white matter uh, becomes fading matter. And now we need white fuel, which is orange fuel with the Philosopher's Stone. So we just go orange. Well, we can just type in fuel. And we can request for orange fuel to be made. And we notice over here building up the yellow fuel for this so we just need it to know that orange fuel is made like this we want it XC white fuel to be made like this okay so now it has the orange fuel and the white fuel so what were we working on fading matter that's right Um, so 
we can take the four of these and make white fuel. So we should now be able to make the here are the here thirteen power flowers. So let's go power flower and uh, thirteen. Okay, so we can make the thirteen here. Should be done right about here. Once we look here, scheduled, scheduled. Cannot remember what upgrades just been. But it, it's pretty much going as fast as it can. As soon as it's putting it in there, it's making them. I might teach it that uh, a stack of, or, or several stacks of these, makes one stack of those. Alright, um... Because that might speed things up here. All right, so we've got our first orange one. You may have noticed, for some odd reason, the quest completion for these did not complete. That's because it stuck back at 10. So I would like to teach this the tier 10 power flower. Um, tier 10 here. Teach this recipe to it. And Uh, patterns. Let's just grab another stack. If we can. And what are we missing? We're missing this recipe. This way now. We should be able to upgrade our 10 to the 11th one. Okay, so just need to find the real. EMC link. Okay, so now we have the EMC link. Just so we can complete these quests. Okay. Um... Now I should be able to go EMC link for well, right? All right, so now we have uh, those two, so we should be able to now quest. 
let's let's look here. Do we get the twelve? Yes. So now, uh, EMC link for level thirteen. Okay, so it just take a little bit for the EMC links for level thirteen to get done. Right, so we've got that. Now we've got flowers. Quest two of these. And I could actually put in a third EMC flower, so. Right, so we see here that this one's crafting this and this is crafting this. So, yeah, we'll let those craft. Uh, we're now getting, what, 222 billion EMC per link. And, hmm. All right. Now that that's done, getting a little bit of this backlog stuff done up, uh, I am going to take a quick break and figure out what we're going to do for the rest of this episode. All right. I have two quick pathways I want to go. I've already increased the power for this. I've cleaned up this a little bit. I need to clean up this marketplace. Um, and I want to make a, a wireless grid. Um... The wireless universal grid. Uh, not there. Here. So let's see here. It requires us to make all three of these. So let's make the fluid grid first. Which we just need a fluid grid. Which requires a grid. And I have taught this how to make this. I think we're going to need three of these. Should have, I should have already have had that done. Oh, I did move this over here because of the other uh, aspect. What I want to do. So. Uh, Okay, we've got three grids. We can make one of these into a fracking grid, a uh, fluid grid, wireless grid, and rafting grid. Okay, so wireless fluid grid. Oh, let's let's do this in the right one, Malcor. If we also type grid, make now the wire or the fluid grid. So we should be able to do this. Make the wireless fluid grid. Uh, the wireless grid and the wireless rafting grid. Oh, okay. Uh, so let's make one more grid here. So we can make a wireless grid. Uh, wireless crafting grid. Oh, okay. So you can make the wireless. Okay, I should have done that. Okay, so now we've got the wireless universal grid here. We want us a wireless transmitter. 
we're going to go with the advanced one. Uh, and I would like the infinite range booster, which requires us to make three upgrades. Let's teach this upgrades because we're going to need it. Teach you this, teach you the range. And toss those in. So we can just type in range. I get three of these because we want to make that infinite range booster. And, oh, it looks like we're going to need four of these. So we're going to need some, let's see, three more each. So nine. Of these range boosters. That way, if we go anywhere, we'll have access to our stock. So we can do Dimension Booster, there we go. So we set this Advanced Booster, or Advanced one here, we put the Dimension in, should be able to now, uh, if we had power, so let's get that Energy Cube out. Set it over here. This. Because this won't be running all the time. So. Okay, so if we hit that with there, so we should be able to see all of our stuff. We can craft wherever we want. And that is the first thing we want it done. The second thing, um, I would like to get the ultimate research tier unlocked. So to do that, we're going to need uh, 21 of these set up in a one, three, five, seven, then back down. So one, three, five, Back down to one over here, so the bust out a little bit here to do this. Okay, so I'm going to expand this out a little bit more.
so we can take it all in. Okay, to power this, uh, I want to, you know, not that. To power this, I wanted to do that. Okay, so that should be powered. And now we have to right click, no. Right click to, with an empty hand to take it out. Uh, I want to have everything Going into set location. That looks like it will all go to here. All right, so now we need a barrel. Don't have this taught to the system yet, so let's get us uh, crafting bread. We need a barrel. We want it JEI synchronized. Get the Minecraft barrel taught to the system. We have access to all of our uh, EMC stuff now with this. So to make one of these, we're going to need one fading matter for netherite ingots. So let's get that fading matter. I uh, on netherite ingots. Four of those. Uh, we need Gaia ingots, it looks, if I'm remembering correctly, a total of eight Gaia ingots. We have this taught here, so now we can just request Gaia ingots. Uh, let's see, okay. fading, got it. And uh, do, 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 two, three, four, eight, twelve of the tetrine. We'll just grab thirty two of these. So we'll start by putting these in the outer ones. like so. We can set the fading in the center. Set these four here. And as soon as I place this last one here, we should see it all working together to make the ultimate research here. Uh, I would have liked to have automated this, but you know, we got the ultimate research tier now, so uh, that unlocks the creative end game for us. And we could get something along the lines of this creative motor um, to power everything really would not be that hard to do. Um, we can get the creative crafter here. 
which does not use any uh, RF. So that, that might be something we get first as the creative crafters. Uh, yeah, or let's see here. We will have to go into mechanism. So that is what we're going to go into next time is mechanism to start work on getting the creative chemical tank. I might, might make, no, can't make that. I, uh, how about this? The everlasting gluttony pool. Uh, the Essence of Haven, which requires 37 of these guys. Might make one of these, or, the, or, or get this automated between episodes. I'm not sure. Maybe uh, next episode we'll automate this and the creation of... Uh, doo -doo -doo. Uh, wish we could get some of this stuff here. Maybe the creation of the essence of Haven as well, because we're going to need that for a few other stuff. So until next time, if you like this episode, hit that like button. If you dislike this episode, go right ahead, hit that dislike. Tell me why you disliked it down in the comments. Uh, so I can improve next time. If you guys have suggestions for the next mod pack, or, uh, give it to me so I can start looking into it and picking the next mod pack for this YouTube channel. And until next time, later Gators.